Hi guys, welcome back with me. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe this channel. European stocks lower, UK takes U-turn, credit Swiss was in focus. European stock market stretched sharply lower Monday, weighed head by renewed regional energy concern, political turmoil in the UK, and worries about the hold of Swiss making yen credit Swiss. By 3 and 2580, the DAX in Germany trade one person lower, the CAC 40 in France fell one person. And new case FTSE 100 drop all point six percent. Persian Energy gains gas from suspended its gas supplies to Italy over the weekend in what appears to be the last iteration of the conflict between Moscow and Western Europe over the supply of natural gas since Russia invasion of Ukraine in February. Any, the Italian oil and gas company, said it expected the hot in gas flow to continue into Monday. The European Union Energy Minister announced plan on Friday to introduce windfall profit taxes on energy firms, and EU leaders are set to meet at the end of the week to discuss how to step up support for Ukraine and their join next step to team soaring energy price. Elsewhere, the, politi the political turbulence in the UK continue. Finance Minister Kaw Kawasi Kwarteng announced Monday that he has abandoned plans to cut the top rate of income tax, a move that had contribute toward sharp falls in the pound and UK bonds. Premier Minister Liz Drew attempt over the weekend to defend her government plan to substantially cut takeaways, including the removal of the highest income tax rate, but several high-profile conservative party figures come out against the move over the weekend making the position untenable. In corporate news, Credit Suisse stock fell over 6% after the Financial Times report on Sunday that the Swiss bank executive spent the weekend reassuring investors about its financial health. This followed the bank credit default swap which over protection gains a company defaulting rising sharply on Friday, climbing to the highest level in at least 10 years. The main data released Monday will be the last German manufacturing PMA number, PMI number, which is expected to show this sector of the Eurozone's economic powerhouse had contracted further in September. Oil prices soared Monday on speculation that a group of top producers will agree to a hefty output cut in order to support a market which has seen four straight months of losses. The organization of the petroleum exporting countries and allies together called OPEC is set to meet on Wednesday and Reuters has reported that the members are considering an output cut of more than 1 million barrels a day. If agreed, this, word, this would be the large reduction since the pandemic and would follow on from the cut of a uh, hundred and thousand barrels per day last month by three uh, 2580 U u.s crude future trade 3.4 percent higher at 82.17 a barrel dollar will the barren contract cross 3.3 percent to 87 and 95 dollar additional gold future trade flat at one Billion one 
5671 as well EO or USD trade open 2% higher at 9815 Okay, maybe that's all from me. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe this channel.